Hi guys, this is uh, the first video of a series of short videos that is going to explain you basically how to format your Word document uh, for Kindle. Uh, the main thing to consider about uh, Kindle formatting is that uh, Kindle requires a very plain formatting. Um, there are certain uh, formats that don't convert well, so you need to make sure to get rid of anything fancy, any fancy style, um, anything, anything that won't be basically recognized by, by Kindle. Uh, so this is um, a Word document that uh, he, it has been given to me to format and um, the first thing, uh, th th there is two steps that ensure to get rid of anything or any fancy style that won't be recognized. So the first thing that you need to do is um, select your whole document. Don't worry about this uh, at this stage about headings and subheadings. We are going to worry about those in, in our next video. Here, um, this is uh, the first step of uh, formatting your body text. So uh, no worries about headings and subheadings. So select all your, all your text, go to change style style set and select simple once you've done that uh, go to no click normal and then do right click and go to modify and we need to make sure that the font is a plain font what what kindle describes as a plain font and plain font are uh, cambria calibri verdana aria or times new roman so here is so showing something different so i'm gonna go i'm gonna click on the arrow and i'm gonna choose for example calibri i'm happy with, with it and in terms of the size uh, i could leave 11 or i could choose another size uh, it doesn't really matter which one you choose um, because uh, you as a reader um, you can select uh, the font and size of your choice when you read a book in, in Kindle. So here is just select the one that is your preferred font and size for your working document. While we are here, the, um, what I do as well, I justi justify all the body text. So I go to format, paragraph, alignment, and I change to justify. I click OK. And I click OK, and now you can see that all my body text is justified. Um, the other thing I do, go back to normal, I do and do right click, and click on update normal to match selection. The reason you do that is that when, for example, you add a new paragraph or new text, hi, I am Elena, you ensure that that new text is the same as the existing text so there you go guys this is how to format your body text of your document in the next video we are going to talk about how to ensure paragraphs and page breaks are set correctly so see you in the next video